or you can leave two blank, it doesn't matter. Uh, so yeah, that's the 222 series. Now, recently these came out. These are basically pretty similar to the old lever Wagos. They've just made them easier to use because I think some people were having problems lifting up these levers because they can. I mean, you can see it leaves an imprint in your finger. Yeah, you do need a, they, they can be a bit fiddly, especially if you've got sausage fingers, but uh, they're fine. Once you get used to them, you can be quite rough with them. You're, you're gonna be hard, you're gonna find it harder to, to break those levers, but they still do take a bit of force because you can see you get a bit of indentation on your fingers. So uh, what they've done is they've made them a little bit easier to lift up. In fact, it's a lot easier to lift up. And also, they've made them smaller. So if you can see, they take up less room. So if we have a look at the three one, you see the size difference. It doesn't look like there's much of a size difference, but because they're so flat, they take up much less room. So now you can, like, if they're on top of each other, can you see? Because normally you are stuck for space when you're working in working in the back boxes. But can you see that they take up a lot less room? Because two of them on top of each other take up a lot more than them. So the new ones are lovely. You can still get the old ones, but uh, well, it depends when you're watching the video. But uh, yeah, so same same applies again. You have the There you see you have a little guide there that says strip it back 11 was that 11 millimeters if you can see there it says 11 on the side and it will be printed on all of them they're really well made again 11 but the same applies again lift the lever up push it in close it down job done nice and tight and again this will have a test there we go, it says test, you won't see it's too small, but it says test at the back here, and you can get your probe, and you can push it in there to do your testing. So, okay, it just gets quite confusing with all the different, uh, with all the different item, item codes. So with these ones, these come in again in a two, a three, and a five lever, and this is the 221 series. So the two lever would be 221412, Three lever is two two one four one three, and the five lever is two two one four one five. And this one here, if you have a look on there, slightly different than the older levers. Okay, but again, you can pause that. Once you find out the ones you like, you can pause it, and then you can get all that information from Google. So that's that one there. Also, you get little leaflets and stuff that tell you different things about it. If you want to have a look at that, and maybe you can pause that. Okay, there's those ones. Now, then we also have push Wagos. Now, this is the older type. This is the 773 series. And basically, uh, again, they do exactly the same job. They're just connecting one wire. On this one here, you'd be connecting one wire to seven other wires. They're slightly more compact than the lever ones, but they ha are harder to use. Now, all these Wagos are reusable, but... Uh, these are harder to use because once you push the wire in, so you push the wire in until it goes to the very end there. Again, the measurements are all on here again. I think these ones, it says to strip back. These ones are 12 millimeters you have to strip back. Obviously, I've just stri stripped back 10 millimeters because I used it on the other one, but you can see it still made the contact. Uh, but you might as well do it 12 millimeters because that's what it tells you to do. So you push them in and then you get your other you know, your other wire, push them in there. So here I've done a uh, 1.5 millimeter wire and a 2.5 millimeter wire. Now, the problem with these is, is taking them out. You can take them out and you're supposed to, you know, Wago say you can take them out, but it is more fiddly. The other ones are just a lever you just lift up. With these ones, you have to twist and pull them out. So you have to twist them to get them out. But when you don't twist them, you can see they are really very strongly in there like really strongly in there so they don't come out but then to get them out you just twist and, and pull at the same time and then they do come out and you can see what it does you can see the way it bites onto it so they are they are reusable uh, yeah so you get them in two 
four, six, and eight. And these are nice because they take up less space. So with the lever ones, they're five, but with this one here, it's eight. And can you see it's roughly, well, the eight is actually smaller. So these are handy, especially when you haven't got a lot of space. And also the push ones are cheaper, but you can't use flex on them.